Okay, this is a review for the R6 DAP. It's the newest, first DAP released by a company named Hibby that is well known for their uh, music app that is used by a lot of other DAP manufacturers. Um, and this is their first go at their own DAP. And they absolutely fucking nailed it. Um, right out the box, it's got everything. It's got three gigabytes of RAM. It functions faster than any DAP I've ever had. The difference between this and my phone, a Note 4. Yeah, it's a Note 4. It's kind of old, but it's very, very fast. Um, is I can't tell the difference, which is what I kind of hoped for when I first got into DAPs with the Android interface. I'm not really interested in other DAPs. Um, I want something with an Android because I use that in my daily life, and that's what I want. So um, I've always been drawn to stuff like that. Everything that you see in here outside of the shows at the top has got an Android unit. The shows is in here because it's got a pronounced bass impact, uh, which is its claim to fame. That's it. Um, but this this Hibby's got that too. The one that's next to it, which is an Opus 2, it's got high resolution and it's also got a very wide presentation. The Hibby, it's got that too. Um, the Fio X7 Generation 2. Um, has balanced out, it has coaxial, it has a uh, very customized um, music player. Um, and uh, the Hibby's got that too. Uh, the AR has got a big, beautiful screen and lots of power, and the Hibby's got that too. Um, the Hibby's got everything that I want. I want something that's got the ability to tweak. Um, and this has something called Mage uh, Eight Ball, which is something similar to Viper for Android, uh, and uh, I can I can tweak the sound more uh, precisely than I could with Viper for Android. So if you're somebody that's interested in, um, you know, tweaking like the Cowan Jet Effects and something like that, this will do that. If you just want something that'll play music really good when you turn it on, uh, this is going to do that right away. Um, go over the the build real quick uh i previous to this thought that the most beautiful device i had ever seen was the opus number one the real genuine aluminum version which was just absolutely gorgeous this is better than that this is uh on close inspection uh and in hand the edge is like where this this inner edge where you plug your micro B for charging or data transfer, even it is smooth and polished. The whole thing is, uh, it's, if I designed a DAP, I, I would like to think it would be kind of like this. It's simple um, and beautiful and machined uh, perfectly. Um, it's absolutely gorgeous. It, 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 is, uh, it is a stunner. Now let me get back down to reflecting the ceiling there. Um, it has, uh, let me see, a Snapdragon. The CPU is a Snapdragon, with, uh, unlike the Rock chips. Uh, so it's got, it. that might be part of the reason that it does really good with the benchmarks. Um, it's got four CPU co cores, average or max clock speed of 1.4 gig. The DAC is using is uh, ESS9028 Q2M. It's using two of those. Um, the low-pass filters are the Oppo 1612. It's got two of those. Um, RAM, 3 gigabytes. ROM, 32. Um, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth. It's using Android 6.0.1. It's got a 4.2-inch touchscreen. Um, what would be the flaws of this? So, Because the, the what is good about this is... is I just named everything. Everything in this picture, um, it does its best point. Best base of these would be the Shosey. It's, it's it's just Dear Prudence from the Beatles has a bass line that comes in, I believe, in the left channel only at first. Um, and it's a dong, Dear Prudence, dong. It sounds fantastic on the Shosey. Shosey's got all kinds of problems, but that sounds wonderful more than any of these this is better than that uh at its best game 
Opus 2, very, very well known for resolution. I'm repeating myself, but just for people so you understand. It's got a very wide presentation, um, and it's separation of instruments is fantastic, and the resolution, the detail, is, is outstanding. I think this is better than that. Um, the FIO, using an Android, overlapping it on high-end uh, audio gear and a lot of customization with the, a version of uh, Viper effects, um, this is better than that. It's got uh, the, the, the eight ball, which is just a crazy uh, app. Um, it's got a, a big, beautiful screen, uh, and it's very powerful, the AR. This has got that. Um, so all of the things that I liked about these, this has it combined. I don't think that it's going to be possible for the higher end um, manufacturers to compete with something like this until they start to make three gigs the default because the interactive experience with this DAP is superior to anything else on the market. Um, it is just that uh, outstanding. It's, it's incredible, actually. Um, it is like a phone, but heavy and has amazing uh audio output ability it's 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 absolutely fantastic um started up it's already started up got bob marley in there it has something let me see if i can get in there the speed of how this works uh if, what i just did was not I didn't push and think I it just it's again like uh using a smartphone it's just you expect that stuff when you use a smartphone and that that's what you get when you use this one um this is called mage sound eight ball um now if I touch this down here I can get the slider range settings I can do very very fine tuning um which would be plus or minus 20 the full range I can do middling um, I love that word, and that's a uh, plus or minus 40 range, or I can do excessive, which would be a minus and to a plus 100, so a very wide band of service uh, that I could do for this. I can do the overall temperature of the device, um, make it sound kind of warm, I can make it sound cooler, so depending on the IMs that I'm using or the over ears, I can uh, adjust this to those. Um, the bass extension, the bass texture, the crispness and of the note, um, the vocals. Uh, this the vocals thing actually works exactly as I hoped it would, which is amazing because if you feel like you want to bring vocals a little closer, that actually works. Blows my mind. Don't know what exactly that's doing, but Joe's been you know on XDA forever. It's I, I'd like to know sometime down the road exactly what that is doing. Um, detox, uh, the sibilance, female, uh, female overtones, uh, sibilance, impulse response, um, air, you know, give a sense of air. I can adjust that. Um, and this is, this would be their version of what would be like Viper for Android, except this would be better. Um, it's got, it's much more, it's all on one level, this screen, all of them, uh, and I can control them and I can also control the magnification of what they're doing that a maximum adjustment is you know 10 to 20 or a maximum adjustment is all the way to 100 so I, I have a, an amazing amount of uh, flexibility using this now when I'm moving out of here you can see you, I guess you can't really see just how fast um, this thing moves if I go into Spotify, no, that's I hit the wrong button. Go into Spotify. No, oh, I'm offline. Can I go online? I wonder how fast that would work. Done. Check your P. Connected. Done. Go back up. And then I'm on. I'm on Spotify. Um, this is the same as using a phone. N none of the other DApps that I've ever used made me feel like that. I always knew that I was using something that was, it's a music player first, and everything else is extra, and, and if it works, you, you'd be great. Um, this this feels just like a phone. Uh, if I could talk on this thing, I wouldn't want to because I wouldn't want the noise that goes along with a phone, but it, it, it feels exactly the same. This is what I wanted a few years ago, which was have something that has the interactive ability, and this was 2015 I was talking about this, 14, 
um, with a Note 4 and an X5 Generation 1, and I was saying, why can't I have both? Well, I do, and it was done by Hibby, and it was done by Joe Bloggs, who's from XDA, and who basically was kind of thinking the same thing, that this is the way it's going. Phones are becoming more uh, like audio players, certain lines of them, and certain types of audio players are becoming more like phones and that they do more than just play music. They also, you can check your mail if you want to, like it's an emergency, you don't have your phone with you, you can get online with your DAP and check and see if you got any messages. Um, this is a this is a social device. You are personally socializing via music or you are socializing by checking uh, whatever messenger service that you use because your wife contacts you and you got to check real quick and you don't want to carry your phone. You could message her, bum, 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 using this without a problem. Um, this is the game changer. It's not a game aim ender. There are no end games, despite what people say. I said it, uh, Twister said it, people said it, and then they you got to go back because something comes out later. The, but game changing happens. This is a game changer because of the three gigs that are inside and the way that it's being used. Uh, this is a high quality device. It works very fast. Um, it has finite adjustment ability. Um, it is the finest release of anything I've seen, especially first version since I've been in personal audio. Um, I highly, highly recommend it. Um, I, you know, do I have any the storage would be my only complaint I wish there was two um I I, I wish I, I wish a lot of stuff man um I wish I was 10 years old again I wish I wish I wish I wish I wish if, if this had two storage slots that would be great it doesn't um but that would be a legit complaint uh the people that are complaining about the impedance I'm gonna have a tissue for for you right there um Wipe your tears, you bunch of freaking crybabies. Why do I have to uh, shut up and buy a different dap? Nobody gives a shit about your complaints. If you don't want this one, you buy another one. And I've tried all the other ones, and one of the ones he loves is right there. This thing kicks the crap out of that. Have a tissue. This one's for you, you crybabies. <laughs> <laughs> Why well, you gotta be 10 ohms? Ooh, shut your face. Um, so, the game changer is right here, and everybody's gonna adjust to it. And now you mark my words the top of the line version of future releases are gonna have 3 gigs of RAM, and then they're gonna offer 2 gig or 1. They're gonna have, they're gonna have to split it up, I think, probably, but I don't know that they can not try to compete with this when it comes to the way that you use it. Once these guys that work for other companies get this in their hands and play with it, I don't know how they're not going to have a version with 3 gigs of RAM. How they use that, if that becomes the default, if that becomes just part of the top of the line, um, I don't know. But I, I just don't know how they can get around this now. Uh, this, this, is, this has made a whole new branch of the tree. And I think uh, if I were a company, I'd, I'd feel like I better start going that way or I might lose customers um, talking about the sound of a DAP is something that I don't get into much uh, because most of the sound that you hear is a reflection of the drivers that you have in your ears that's that makes a lot of sense doesn't it do I have to explain that to you guys why that at the final end of the chain the part that's actually in your ears is going to have the most influence on the sound that goes into your brain you don't need that explained do you please come on no you don't um, that said, it has a pronounced sense of bass impact, uh, and it has a very wide stage, which is counterintuitive. It shouldn't be that way. Usually something with an elevated sense of bass does not equate or give rise to the belief that you will also have a very wide presentation. It is, in a sense, counterintuitive. However, this device does exactly that. It gives you a uh, a uh, womp, uh, a thump in bass, and it gives you a very, very wide stage. It's a, it's a really, really impressive device. I recommend this highly. Um, it, I got this for free, and I offered to buy it for pretty much full price. So uh, while I did get this for free, the offer for me to pay for it um, was put out on the table. So, yeah, did you get it for free and you're hyping it? Because that, nah, I, I offered, I offered oh, pretty much close to full money, bro. Um, a lot of people that are asking Joe for favors right now are not doing that. I did that. 
I, I, I feel nothing but smart. And I still got tissues if you need them right over there. Highly wrecked. Best item of 2017.